San Diego to go and see Mark Fabiani, Clinton Whitewater veteran, the guy at the heart of the Clinton crisis management operation. There he is. As I live and breathe. How you doing? Mark Fabiani. Great to see you. Master of disaster. Welcome to San Diego. <laughs> Thank you for having me. Your period of time in the White House was the whole of the first term and then out. I was out. I said I'm leaving uh, on election day and I did. Yeah. You know, it grinds on you. At the time, we regarded all those things as incredibly serious, right? right. Whitewater and travel yeah. office. Jesus. And, Today, compared to what's going on, those things are trivial. What Trump is dealing with are, are a myriad of things, and in some ways, that's what's saving him so far. Right. There is so much on a daily basis, even on an hourly basis, that people can't keep up with it. You don't know what's important, what isn't. You can't understand it unless you're following this stuff religiously. Yeah. He's survived in part because people can't keep up. There's a weird kind of magic to Trump. He did destroy 16 Republicans on the way to the Republican nomination. And today, given all of the scandals, he's at like 42. That's correct. Like no mortal should be at 42. Well, I think you explain it. First of all, the economy is good. Yeah. And so people see that and they benefit from it. And that benefited President Clinton too. The economy was great during those years. And he always got to say, I'm taking care of what's important. I'm taking care of the economy. And Trump can say the same thing. And second, he is dealing with this issue in the best way that he can by sticking to some basic messages. It's partisan, it's a witch hunt, there's no collusion. He sticks with them relentlessly, and then he just moves forward. He's not slowed down by anything. And so he deserves a lot of credit for managing it in that way. Now, I think ultimately, the fact that he doesn't have good lawyers around him, yeah. that may be his undoing. But so far, he's survived in a situation that would have brought down almost anybody else we're familiar with in our lifetime.